Hi guys, how are you? Guess who is here? Adam is in the house, the pharaoh. So today we're gonna speak about the, our my fight with uh, Sisei. He's uh, he's originally from Senegal and he lives in France. It was a very strong fight. It was a very very nice experience. I really enjoyed it. Uh, my name is Adam Sabri. I'm a professional fighter in karate combat and I'm from Egypt yeah that's our flag and that was my first fight with karate combat so here we're gonna start we start the fight check hands always we start with respect that's karate so now we keep like moving, we keep like checking each other, see what's, how is the distance, see like uh, what you have and making sure that also that you're having your, uh, you see everything and you have your distance and you be aware of what's going on. So he, he, he put me on the floor and I grab him so he can't, he have no distance to punch because once you go down on the floor you have five seconds so you can keep punching so once I kept him and I grab him he can't do nothing uh, he, actually first round I I can like I can tell that like, I can know that uh, first round here he put me on the floor again I went down I'm putting my face right close to him so there is no distance between me and him to go for the punch back and forward so the first round I didn't do as I was saying I didn't do a lot as much as I was just getting to see like this is new mats for me this is like new atmosphere that's uh, everything everything was new here I'm grabbing when we're doing some hooks from the clinch the floor after the, the referee said stop the fight so first round I was just doing that which I know that after the first round ends I know that I lost this round so actually I have no choice except that I have to push myself to start winning But I know that they're gonna get it back. Like I know this is gonna end by me winning. Here's some hooks. It was a very very strong fight. just the thing that I uh, I felt that I need I need to be more uh, loose that's what I'm working on now to be more loose I was uh, a little bit putting more tense because it was the first time for us to do this uh, this fight it was the first time for me it was his second fight he won his first fight so that was his first fight for me S boom that's a nice sweep from me and here we going going forward trying to knock him out he pushed me with his leg and that was the last thing before the round end so here I get back I know that this round is not for me so now I'm thinking that I have to I have two more rounds out of three rounds I lost the first one so I have to win those two rounds no choice so I was breathing I was relaxing my coach was helping me telling me that I have to go more my sensei Do you like my head guys don't you <laughs> And here, last sip of water, get in, 
get to work referee is backing us up before we start and go so here we start the fight boom here is hooks wow from the close distance and we start doing hooks wow here I'm whacking up I got a strong punch here but I didn't fall down I said to myself no you're not falling down just stand up and fight so here look at my face you can see the punch so one thing about it I have a light dark skin he has um, a dark dark skin so you can't see for his face if he got like uh, wow look at that here's the same thing uh, once I get into the on the floor I just grab him so he can't he can't do there is no distance between me and him so he can't really punch he can't really do anything he wants Here we're checking, we're checking, check, fight back and forth, back and forth, and we keep like seeing. And he is trying to sweep and closing the distance, and he's trying to figure out the way to get him to, to take the sweep down, to take him down again. Here I'm moving, being light, my feet. He's a referee, go fight. So take away from the distance. We were tired. But I was in a good condition, so I continued like. Uh, here, going punches. Free stop the match, start again. Here, going forward. There is no backing up, just forward, being aggressive. He is spinning hook kick almost to his face, almost to his nose, touching his nose. And here is a hook. He's grabbing my oh he is double hooks for me. He fall down on the floor. He was grabbing a lot of my uh, from my belt, my pants. Here we're trying to sweep, trying to figure out the distance, going forward with the front leg to get get him away with the distance, close the distance with my front leg, then going forward and down the second one. I know I got the second one. Especially I knock him down with my punch, he fall down on the floor, so that's like it will not end ten to nine and you know the boxing system. 10 to 8 so here I was speaking to myself like listen my sense is speaking to me listen like you're gonna you're gonna work hard this is the last round last three minutes it will be done you're gonna have fun after it fight will be fun done you're gonna be the winner just work hard this round just three minutes away put your hundred percent on those three minutes so I was feeling good. And here we're gonna start and start the fight. So round three, I'm going for a knockout. So trying to see, making sure that nothing gonna come to me and in the same time I wanna clear punches or clear kicks here I got a punch close the distance trying to sweep 
getting him from the close distance, some punches, grabbing my pants, which is not allowed. That's an Egyptian move. Here, for the distance, some hooks to the liver, get him tired. Here, checking with the front leg. Sometimes you just check, see what's like. If the one in front of you is focusing, you just need to get him like, okay, check him, let him lose his, okay. So then start again. Here are some punches, strong punches from the close distance. And he's selling the referee, he's telling him to stop grabbing the pants. He was grabbing it alone. He was tired. He was in a better condition. I can see it in his face. I can tell. Boom! A spinning hook kick to the face. Two hooks to the face. Here he did a head with his head and he told the referee that it's me. And the referee told me blue. Watch out. He didn't see it, I'm sure the referee. But it was smart from other fighter. Here this roundhouse to following with two punches to the face. Knock him down to the floor. Going above him. One two three four and the referee will stop it with the sub the fight because i just have five seconds to knock him out it was it was really really good i was enjoying that and two hooks and strong hooks knock him down to the floor again going above him one two three four and stop was well, that close to knock him out that close and I was really in a good condition he was done I can tell I'm going forward fighting going forward no backing up and it gonna be it's almost done the fight I'm going forward I'm sure he is now he's praying to end the fight I'm going and time I was wishing that it was he was done look at the difference guys there was beautiful kicks I have beautiful kicks I didn't show them a lot and you will get to see them more next fight hopefully and here we were waiting for the referee the referees to get the points to see who's the winner I know that I'm the winner before they say you just kind of feel it you feel what you did in the match it was a close fight but I make it clear in the third round by knocking him down two to three times I didn't get knocked out, uh, knocked down once. Here we're waiting. Some people said we're gonna go because you know in karate combat, if you if it's a draw, we're gonna go for the fourth round. So we're gonna start the fourth round, and the winner of the fourth round is the winner of the match. Here grabbing some water. That's what the reason why, because we may have fourth round. That's what they, uh, some people said to me while I'm here. So I take a sip of water and we're waiting for it. Washing my face as I just take a shower. And now they're gonna say, it. so there is no fourth round. We're waiting for the call, who's gonna win. 
and the winner is The win is me. Isha. It was a very, very nice experience. I loved it. I enjoyed it a lot. Here, since Imam Duh, he really helped me a lot. And uh, he was helping me every day before the fight. And I'm very thankful for him. Very thankful for my family, for everybody who supports me. For my girl, what's she gonna give me? And it's done.